Welchick. I'm part of the sociology group that is making this video. And when trying to come up with an idea for what to do for our project, we noticed that homelessness is becoming really prevalent in our society, and especially in La Crosse, Wisconsin, where Viterbo University is. We wanted to come up with something that would help the people here, but we were kind of at a standstill. We didn't know how to help. That's when one of the other members of our group, Megan Mesa, introduced us to a project that the Enactus group had started called the Mitten Project. They needed help. They had run out of supplies. They had run out of people to help cut out the mittens that we are going to help them make and sell to help raise funds for homelessness awareness in La Crosse, Wisconsin. My name is Bailey Benson, and I am a member of the club called Enactus on Campus, and it's um, a service club who really focuses on creating these service projects and implementing them into the community. And um, my um, position on the club is secretary um, for this specific project with the mittens. I am the co-chair of the whole project. I am Katrina Volker, and I am faculty advisor for our Enactus Club here at Turbo. I am Miranda Mishka, I'm a sophomore English education major, and I am a participant in this project. We start with these unwanted, unloved materials, so sweaters that no one can use anymore, and fleece, and we get almost all of our uh, materials donated. Our mittens are made from re purposed, upcycled, old sweaters and fleece. Eventually we're going to sell them and the purpose of our project is to raise money for people who are homeless. So our real initiative is to get out in the community and um, make an impact and the focus of our impact is with people who are homeless. Our goal of course is to help the homeless and when we first started we thought we would make mittens and give them. Um, Bailey, who you are also hearing from, pointed out that one of our goals is not just to comfort people who are suffering from that homelessness, but to help them out of homelessness. Mm -hmm. So partway through the project we decided we can really get more done by selling the mittens and with the proceeds then we can um, work with the lacrosse area groups that are already working with the homeless mm -hmm. and that our money can probably go further with an organized group than just the mittens themselves. This project is just an example of amazing people getting together and helping their own community, of mm -hmm. making the community more of a family rather than just seeing people who are homeless and leaving them be. You know, it's, it's getting to the heart of of service, of what it means to help another person and to be a neighbor and a friend. Alright, so this project is really meaningful for me, partly because when I think of homelessness, like, I don't think there's, like, there's stuff I can do, but I don't think there's, like, I don't know a homeless person's needs specifically. Mm -hmm. I don't think I have the services to provide them. Um, but this way, in this project, like, I can sew, like, I can cut fleece. I can match sweaters together, like I am enabled in this project and I feel like I can contribute something in a way that's meaningful and really impactful, so that's real, why I really enjoy this project. And so having an opportunity to take something that would be wasted or moldering away in someone's closet and being able to make something beautiful that you know is warm and can help people in so many ways, it just really means a lot to me. As a group, we decided we wanted, wanted to set aside a whole day to just make mittens. So we decided on a date, and in the days preceding, we went to Salvation Army and collected donated sweaters that they couldn't use, they didn't have a use for, they couldn't sell them. So it was upcycling rather than recycling. Then on Saturday, March 2nd, from 9 to 5, we brought in volunteers and spent the entire day cutting out patterns for the Enactus group to sew to make mittens.